It is now my singular honor and pleasure duty to invite the ACDF PNL to read the biography and thereafter invite the VCDF. ACDF, sir. Your Excellency, the President of the Republic of Kenya and Commander-in-Chief of the Defense Forces, sir. Permit me to ride on established protocols. I have the honor and singular duty to read the biography of the late General Francis Omondi Ogola. My name is Major General David Keteri, the Assistant Chief of Defense Forces in charge of personnel and logistics. The late General Ogola was my mentor, and I was directly answerable to him on personnel and logistic matters. General Francis Omondi Ogola was born on 12th February 1962 in Siaya County. He was enlisted into the Kenya Defense Forces as an officer cadet on 2nd May 1984 and commissioned as a second lieutenant on that May 1985, upon which he was posted to Moy Air Base, where he trained as a pilot. During his career in the Kenya Defense Forces, General Ogola held several command, staff, and instructional appointments. In command, he was appointed the commanding officer like Ibia Air Base, tactical flight in 2007, and also the base commander like Ipia Air Base from the year 2008 to 2014. Upon promotion to Brigadier on 10th April 2012, he was appointed the Deputy Air Force Commander and later on promoted to a Major General on 13th July 2018 and appointed the Commander Kenya Air Force. On 23rd July 2021, he was also promoted to the rank of a lieutenant and appointed the Vice Chief of Defense Forces, a position he held till 28 April 2023 when he was promoted to the rank of a general and appointed the Chief of Defense Forces. From my interaction with the late General Ogola, I can attest that he had a welfare of the Kenya Defense Forces at heart. He ensured that he frequently visited troops in both deep and close operation areas and promptly addressed challenges in the field. He encouraged members of Kenya Defense Forces to keep fit, and this he led by example, by ensuring he attended by weekly sporting activities at this complex facility. His last group physical activity was the annual defense Forces Physical Readiness Test, which was conducted this week on Tuesday, 16th April 2024, on this very ground. Being the Chief of Defense Forces, he did not have to attend the exercise due to his extremely busy schedule, but he chose to lead from the front by participating in the exercise, just like the rest of KDF personnel, in sync with his command philosophy one force, one mission. Due to his dedication to service, the late General Francis Omondi Okola was awarded several medals, among them Elder of the Order of the Golden Heart, Elder of the Panning Spear, Head of State Commendation, among other, others. The cruel hand of death has robbed his family of a loved one. Kenya Defense Forces, the country has lost a patriotic and hard-working general officer. He will be missed by his family, relatives, colleagues, friends, and nation at large. I wish to express my deep condolences to his wife, Madam, Madam Hailin Kadambi Ogola, his children, Lona Acheng Omondi and Joel Rabuku Omondi Ogola, his daughter-in-law, Mudoni Njenga Maura, his grandson, Master Taji Bagara, his friends, family, relatives, and colleagues. May the Almighty God rest his soul in eternal peace 
and grant abundant comfort to members of his family. Your Excellency, sir, it is my humble duty and honor to kindly invite the Vice Chief of Defense Forces to give his remarks. VCDF, sir.